Hello guys, my name is Prince and this is my center. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos. Post your comments and questions on my social media handles and I'll respond to it. We are on the topic mensuration. In the previous video, we solved a question on finding the area and circumference of a circle. In this video, we are going to learn how to find the length of an arc. In the video on parts of circles, we learned that an arc is a part of the circumference. So for example, in this circle here, where O is the center, we know that OA is a radius and OB is also a radius. Now you can see that this angle theta is being formed between these two radii. AB is an arc. We have this minor arc AB and the major arc AB. The length of this minor arc AB is given by theta, which is the angle between the two radii, divided by 360 degrees times 2 pi r. The length of the major arc AB is given by 360 degrees minus theta divided by 360 degrees times 2 pi r. So for the minor arc, the formula is theta, and theta is the angle between the two radii, divided by 360 degrees times 2 pi r. For the major arc AB, the formula is 360 degrees minus theta, divided by 360 degrees times 2 pi r. Let's use these to solve some questions. Find the length of the minor and major arc PQ in the diagram below. So we have this diagram with the arc PQ. And we are supposed to find the length of the minor arc PQ and the major arc PQ. So for this question 2, this point here is O, where O is the center of the circle. Okay. And we are supposed to find the length of the minor arc PQ and the major arc PQ. We learned that the length of the minor arc PQ is equal to theta, which is the angle formed between the two radii, divided by 360 degrees times 2 pi r. So we have theta divided by 360 degrees times 2 pi r. R, where R is the radius of the circle and we have that as 28 centimeters and theta is the angle between the two radii which is 110 degrees. So this is going to give us 110 degrees divided by 360 degrees times 2 times pi times 28 centimeters. When you do this on your calculator you are going to have 53.8 centimeters. So the length of the minor arc is 53.8 centimeters. For the major arc, we learned that the length of the major arc PQ is equal to 360 degrees minus theta divided by 360 degrees times 2 pi r. But we know that theta is 110 degrees. So this is going to give us 360 degrees minus 110 degrees divided by 360 degrees times 2 times pi times 28 centimeters since r is 28 centimeters when you do this on your calculator you are going to have 122.2 centimeters so the length of the major arc pq is 122.2 centimeters thank you for watching this video I hope this video was helpful. Subscribe to this channel for more videos. In the next video, we are going to learn how to find the area and perimeter of a sector. Bye-bye.